Hi there, my name is Raul and today in this quick video I'm going to be showing you how to create and configure your quick replies. From here, from the settings, you have a quick reply section from where you can create different types of quick replies. You have a default reply, an interactive list reply and reply buttons. So I'm going to be showing you quickly how to do it. First of all, the default reply is just a simple quick reply that you can uh, configure with a title, the message which you want to send um, quickly, of course. And uh, if you want to add an image, you can do so from here. OK, at the same time, you're going to have the interactive list replies that I'm going to be showing you how it looks like. From here, you're going to be able to create it with a title, a header, uh, of course, the bottom's names, okay, and a description. And from here below, you're going to be able to see exactly the preview of that uh, message, which you're going to be configuring as a interactive list reply, okay? Here you have the basic configuration, and you have a second section where you're going to be able to create the different sections of your interactive list reply, or as we call it, a menu. From here, you're going to be able to give a title to that section and add all the information regarding the section itself. So once your customer um, is going to be clicking on the menu, you're going to be able to see it like this. OK, so they're going to be able to click on it and send that reply or that um, quick reply directly to you. OK, so from here in the preview, you're going to be able to see it as such and click even on the uh, menu button so that all the sections appear the same way as it will appear for your customers. Apart from that, if we go directly into uh, the, quick, uh, the quick replies again, you're going to be able also to see the buttons, uh, quick replies, which allows you the same way to, first of all, configure a title, configure a header, the text, if you want to add a caption, there is an optional uh, space here to add a caption and you can add the buttons. You can see here that you have uh, up to three buttons to include. OK, so for example, yes, please. OK, let's say. And here you have the preview of how it will look uh, in the face of your customers directly on WhatsApp. You have here the message and directly the buttons for them to just press and send you the quick reply. So it's pretty easy. And even here on the buttons reply, you're going to be able to choose if you just want to add a text or if you also want to add an image, a video or a document. So basically the buttons message can also include media. All right. So it's pretty useful. Of course, uh, the idea for you to create this apart from using them directly with your um, customers conversations is that you're going to be able to configure them directly inside the bot. So if we go here into a bot, you can see that actually you're going to have the possibility. OK, once you start creating the uh, bot flow, one of the actions that you're going to be able to add is, as you see here, the quick reply, the interactive list reply or the bottom message. So basically, let's say if you're going to add the bottom message, here is going to give you the list of all the uh, quick button messages or quick button replies that you have created in the previous section. And for you to just simply click on one, OK, you have here the preview and then it appears directly here on your bot ready for it to be activated as soon as you have a message from your customers. So uh, this is basically how to create them. Please contact us if you have any questions.